Chris, can you tell me a little bit about the computer modeling prior to building the Jet Dragster? Absolutely. You know, this is a five-year project, but that doesn't mean that on day one you start cutting tubing and bending metal. The, the process is an enormous process. This isn't a kit car, and there's no instructions at the, at the beginning of the day. We do have specific parameters that we have to build the driver's compartment to, safety guidelines that help keep your lane safe, and we exceed those good standards all the time anyway. Thank you. But, yeah. um, uh, you know, it's an interesting thing because the students here at Embry-Riddle have been trained to do things like uh, fluid analysis, computational fluid dynamics, we call it. You don't always have to run in a wind tunnel to get the aerodynamic analysis of these cars, and so we can do computer modeling. The computational fluid dynamics, if you actually take a tour here at Embry-Riddle, you'll see a number of different laboratories that have pictures of fluid dynamics, and, yes. and of course there's a lot of colors and stuff in those pictures where where some of the air flows are stagnant and, and, and not doing their best, those colors get real red, and some of the areas that they're doing really well, guess what, the color is green. And, and so, and, but also, not just from an aerodynamic standpoint, we typically try and design these cars for like the up to 350 mile an hour range. That's, you know, we try and have a little bit of safety window at the end of how fast the lane's gonna go. But also on top of that, from a structure standpoint, we get mechanical engineering involved, another very strong area for Embry-Riddle, and we get the mechanical engineers involved. They actually have a whole structures team that follows this group. Those guys are the ones that are designing the chassis, the tubing. It, you know, it looks like a fairly simple car. There's no suspension on either end. It's a solid mounted car. The chassis itself becomes the suspension. It's designed to flex in certain areas. It's designed not to flex in certain areas. And so this deflection of the chassis, how the body is mounted, some of the panels, even the way the engine is mounted and the angle it's mounted on are critical factors to the design of these cars. And that's all done right here at Ember Riddle and Prescott. Elaine was saying that um, the cover on, on the car is uh, a little bit big because you downsized it uh, to make it more efficient. It is, you know, we have, the, the body of this car is very unique. We've designed some very new safety innovations that we've talked to some of the major sanctioning bodies about, some things that they want, they've want, wanted to try for years that some of the competitive cars didn't want to do because it would, might give them a competitive disadvantage. So we designed some of those uh, energy absorbing uh, points in the car. Areas that in a crash um, would absorb the energy rather than all that energy hitting the driver's compartment and ultimately hitting the lane. Wonderful, wonderful. Thank you, and thank you for everything you do. And what I would like to share with you guys is, as you probably know, Jay Leno is a jet dragster guy. So can we just say, hey Jay, come on, uh, check us out, what we're up to, tweet us, uh, link us and like us. You know, Jay Leno is a great car guy. He has an entire museum that's an amazing place. He believes in this country. He believes where we came from. And he's one of the key people that can help bring us back to where we deserve to be. So give a shout out to Jay. Well, let's go, Jay. And come on jet racing with us sometime. We'll, we'll bring your cars out. And it, he, you know, he has a bunch of jet cars and stuff, but he always drives that Stanley Steamer car. <laughs> okay. he, he does, am I right? Am I right? And so it, that's the coolest thing, because that's a, one of the first green energy cars right there. But, but yeah, Jay Leno is a great car guy. He's a great American. And he is one of the guys that can take us to the new level. And, and a person in that position publicly has the strength and the power to do what we need to do. Yeah. So, so come check us out, Jay. Anything you'd like to say to Jay? Hey, Jay, how about you come race me sometime? Come on, you can do it. You wouldn't want to get beat by a girl now, would you? Now that's an invitation, and Mavis, you better come along. <laughs> Thank you so much, you guys, for everything you do. Nice to meet you, and we will stick around for the unveiling of this beautiful new dra jet dragster. Thanks so much, and we'll see you soon. Okay, well, hey, guys, taking a quick sneak peek of that brand new 2014 Eagles Fury Jet Dragster. I'm even being quiet when I'm talking to you because we snuck the cover back just a little bit just so you could take a look.